A year ago, a giant Christmas tree lit up Kyiv's old town square. For millions of Ukrainians, it was a magical time. It was fun, it was joyful. Then came February 24th, 2022. The United States estimates 40,000 Ukrainian civilians have been killed or wounded since the start of the Russian invasion. Natasha Stepanenko is one of the wounded. She lost a leg in a missile attack at a train station in a Russian-occupied section of eastern Ukraine. Her daughter, Yana, lost both legs in the explosion. Yana was laying on top of the grandmother. Grandmother was dead, and Yana was trying to crawl away from her. Natasha and her daughter are now in San Diego, where they both got prosthetic legs. Ivan Chaban is also undergoing rehabilitation. He lost a leg when a tank ran him over as he was walking with his family to get food. And when dark, and then I fell on the ground. Earlier this month, Heidi Kuhn met with several Ukrainian amputees in San Diego to look for ways to help. Kuhn runs Roots of Peace, a humanitarian group that removes mines from war-torn regions and converts the land to agricultural fields. Roots of Peace launched a fundraising campaign that puts new meaning in the tradition of Christmas stockings. Roots of Peace is designing a Ukrainian Christmas stocking in honor of the children who have lost their legs. The stocking represents the legs lost to the war. The idea is to design stockings with the colors of the Ukrainian flag and then fill them with items all Ukrainians need for the cold winter. Things like blankets, gloves and thermal socks. Energy bars are also needed. It would be a beautiful reminder to any family um, to think of Ukraine and to help Ukraine to think of these children. The war has already changed Christmas in Ukraine, where residents celebrate two Christmases, the Catholic Christmas on December 25th and the Orthodox Christmas on January 7th. But this year, the Orthodox Church of Ukraine will celebrate Christmas on December 25th to distance itself from the Russian Orthodox Church. Yana has a special message to Ukrainian children to be brave and to have a Merry Christmas. To donate to the Ukraine holiday stocking fundraiser, go to rootsofpeace.org.